Have you recently come across videos where women talk about menopause or perimenopause ruining their lives? They describe very awful situations, their lives being thrown into chaos from symptoms that they and their doctors couldn't understand or explain. Or perhaps it wasn't a video. You know somebody who's living that very experience and you might be related so there may be a possibility that you experience the same thing as them. Should you expect perimenopause to be a hormonal change that ruins your life? You're not alone if you're concerned about this because the hormonal changes that happen during this time can affect everything from your mood to your sleep, even your relationships. But is there a way that you can avoid or prevent experiencing those worst symptoms that you heard about? Perimenopause is that important phase of your life when you transition transition to menopause and the end of childbearing years. In some women, it can start in the mid thirties and continue up to 10 years. We usually can say when it begins, but it ends after you've not seen a menstrual period for 12 consecutive months. Problems that some women experience are mood swings, leaving them feeling out of control or a constant brain fog that makes it hard to focus. And what about suddenly you start having difficulty getting to sleep? You might experience joint pains, bowel troubles, and don't even get me started on the poor sex drive. But here's the good news. While perimenopause can feel overwhelming, it doesn't have to ruin your life. Understanding what's happening in your life is the first step to taking back control. First, women will go through the perimenopause and menopause. For a good number of us, we will experience no changes at all. But for the rest of us who might struggle with one degree of distressing symptoms, all in the name of perimenopause and menopause, here are three actionable tips you can take today to manage them. Focus on balancing your hormones with lifestyle changes. My top tips are having a healthy and well-balanced diet, managing stress and exercise. Two, don't be afraid to ask your doctor about perimenopause and any treatments, including hormone therapy and others. It's okay to explore talking therapy or CBT for anxiety and mood changes. Let's stop blaming ourselves for perimenopause or menopause symptoms. For example, brain fog. But consider, could it be happening because of the hormone changes happening in your body? In that case, it would help to speak to your doctor about testing you for possible causes and then finding the right treatment. And make sure you're getting enough sleep. This might mean restructuring your nighttime routine, changing when and what you eat at nighttime, and cutting down on things like caffeine during the daytime. Perimenopause might be a rough ride for many of us, but it doesn't have to ruin your life. So please take small steps at a time don't hesitate to ask for help if you need it we deserve the best during this transition phase of life check out my playlist here for more menopause related tips and solutions and i'll see you again soon